Assalamu alaikum as you guys said to make a video on meteorology so in this video i am giving some background information on meteorology so let's get started meteorology is the study of weather now what is weather so weather is the state of atmosphere atmosphere means air and states are the three states of matter solid liquid and gas so weather is a short term condition of atmosphere of a particular place and these condition may changes constantly from hour to hour minute to minute or second to second so why knowing weather is important weather is useful for our security if you know weather that it is monsoon or sunny so we wear like that or we prepare before that in traveling pilots land or take off the airplane so they must know all the weather parameters for the whole route it is also important for shipping We can build electricity or store water by making dam, placing solar panels, or by using windmills. It is also beneficial for our crops or agriculture. If when we know the weather forecast, so we take care of our crops easily. So there are many types of weather. Some are classified as sunny, windy, cloudy, rainy, or so snowy. So it all depends on certain factors. There are seven factors that affect the weather. In this video, I am just telling the three factors, and in next video, I will continue all the factors. So do like and subscribe to my channel for more. The number one factor is temperature. Temperature is the key factor that affects the weather. It is related to hotness or coldness of the air. If the air temperature is high, then it is sunny weather. If the air temperature is low, then it is rainy, cloudy, or snowy weather. So we can find temperature by Stevenson box. In the Stevenson box, there are four thermometers: dry bulb, wet bulb, maximum thermometer, and minimum thermometer. And the placement of all these thermometer is the Stevenson screen. In all thermometer, we use mercury, but in minimum thermometer, we use alcohol. We take the reading from dry bulb and wet bulb and perform some calculation and find the dew point and relative humidity. And from maximum thermometer and minimum thermometer, we check the overall day maximum and minimum temperature. Yeah. So the next factor is wind speed. Wind speed just tell us that how the wind is moving. It is moving fast or it is moving slow. So we can check this by any more meter. The animal meter gives the reading in knot. Right now it is three six three zero three and it is moving slow. So the number three factor is wind direction. So wind direction just tell us that where the wind is emanates. We can check this by wind compass where the arrow lies in between the two poles. Maybe in northeast or in southeast, northwest or in southwest. So right now the wind is moving in southwest direction. So that's all for now. If this video is helpful for you, please like and subscribe to my channel. See you in the next video. Till then, take care. Bye bye.